Hi guys, this is a Call of Duty Advanced Warfare class setup. It is a really helpful class and it is so helpful in pubs and in MLG. It's great for hardpoint, S and D, uplink and especially domination if you're defending B bomb or your home flag. No, I mean B dom or your home flag. I'm gonna hop into this class with the bow. It is an outstanding class, with, especially with the precision sight red dot. It's going to help you so much in that, and it's going to keep it straight. Especially with this re uh, foregrip, it's going to increase your accuracy by two. Because if you don't have that foregrip on, you're gonna, just going to shoot straight up into the air. But if you're sh just got that re uh, foregrip on and you're shooting, that's going to keep your gun straight. I'd really advise you to use it. Combat knife, I'm going to have that. It's, just, it's good, and it's got a good lunge on it. I think they're going to nerf the bow quickly soon, so guys, you need to get rid of this gun quick. Uh, if, you, if you don't use it, so if I thought the HBR, HBAR3 was going to be the best gun in the game. I used the bow, and it's a class gun. Perk 1 is going to be low profile. Low profile keeps you off the radar from all of it, like UAV and tracking drones. Perk 2, blind eye. It's the same as like the low profile, and if you have them two together, you're pretty much off the radar for everything. Here we go, blast suppressor. It is an amazing perk. If you don't have that, you're going to be always on the radar, unless you're playing classic search and destroy, or classic game mode. Because if you exo jump in, exo launch in, or exo ability in, you're just going to be exo moving, you're just going to be on the radar with the red circle going out pinging everywhere so you're going to be on the radar so the bass suppressor takes it off you go wild card one will be perk three it's going to be toughness and i'm going to do exo stim now the exo stim and the toughness help really well with protection in you in a gunfight and it's really going to help you and some of the places you know it won't be one in ones not a lot of cover that's going to help you regen and yeah so that's going to be, that's really good. I'd advise to use it. Next, I'm going to use a frag, which is just for coolness. I don't know why I'm going to use it. It's just good, and it can distract you to distract players if you're in a one v one on a MLG game. But next, sc first score streak, I'm going to go with U UAV. I'm not going to go with a normal UAV. I'm going to go with enemy direction and an extra points assist. And if I had another luck, I would go for extra time. Because I don't, I'm going to have to have extra points and enemy direction. Enemy direction is going to tell you where the enemy is facing and extra points just for the XP. A second score streak is the uh, Goliath, which is really good, which is a bomb. It's like a juggernaut, but with a uh, minigun. And last but not least, the last slot I can have is going to be the Warbird. It is such a good class. You can use this for MLG except for UAV. So take, just remember to take UAV off on MLG because you will get, you know, the game will, you will lose the game. So if you are playing MLG, just take the UAV off and change it for, or you can not have care package on it. Have, like, excess one Vulcan if you want, whatever you want. But that's going to be the end of the class good class setup with the bow we're going to be doing uploading a lot every day so please subscribe and like to us we are a new clan not not a new clan we are a new channel for youtube we do play a lot of ghosts we're getting good at we we're good at ghosts we're good at advanced warfare not the best yet but we're going to hopefully get quite high in there so please like this video subscribe tell your friends about it and see you later